What if I told you that you can create insane AI images and videos and not pay a single dime for it? Yeah, you heard that right. In this video, I'm showing you two powerful free AIs that can turn your ideas into stunning visuals and cinematic videos in just minutes. No subscriptions, no complicated setup, just plug in your ideas and let the magic happen. Whether you're a content creator, designer, or just love experimenting with AI, you're gonna love this one. So grab your coffee, hit that like button, subscribe, and let's dive right in. So you head over to your browser and search Budget Pixel. This is the home screen of Budget Pixel. You can see the generations of other people. These are the models. You can see Minimax, even the new Sora, two is here, Kling, Veo 3. Yeah, all the models are right here. And this is completely free. So let's take our time to check out other models and generations from other people. This image generation, this is crazy, bro. That looks so realistic. I like it. So this is the image generation page. Here's the home screen of the image generator. Here are other models for image generation and each model has its own required credit per generation. For today's video, I'm gonna be going with Kling. Here's the aspect ratio, 16 to nine. Number of images, I picked one. So I'm just gonna type a prompt right now. And we hit generate. That's 40 credits gone. And here's the generation, here we have it. This looks very realistic. You wouldn't even know it was generated by AI. I prompted it to have her picking something and they got the generation right. That's the water bottle for the gym. Let's check another prompt and hit generate again. We wait and boom, here we have it. This is very cool. As you can see, my name on the background, the plaque, the setup, it, it feels so real. So without much being said, here are our credits. We still have 520 credits, so let's check a realistic prompt and see how this model handles it. We hit generate, wait, and then boom, you can see how realistic it is. Looks like an actual human taking a selfie. Now we're gonna go to the video generator. Video generation takes more credits than image generation. So I'm just gonna use a model that doesn't require too much credit. eight seconds and the way they calculate the credit here is maybe 50 credits per second. So yeah, it's gonna be really expensive. I'm just gonna check the prompt, set up the aspect ratio so I don't waste credits. And then hit generate. Let me try this. And then boom, here's the generation I made. I know, guys, it really didn't get the blur face here, but I guess if I prompted it better, it might have worked. But you can see how realistic and human-like this generation looks. Oh, I saw this on Instagram. People put that. So yeah, we're gonna check out the video effects. You can see all the effects this AI can do. Just take a moment to glance through this. So we have the audio part and here's the model for the audio. 
You can pick, maybe you wanna do a voice generation. Here's your go-to for it. Here's the home screen. Here's the setup. So yeah, you all should feel free to come check this AI out. And since I can't use the video generation with my credits anymore, I'm just gonna make more images with this AI. Same prompt, but different models. Let's see how it goes. Here's the generation. And you can see this model got the whole prompt really well compared to the previous one, but it required more credits. And this is the other AI I'm talking about. It has a background remover and image upscaler. Yeah, I already tried the image upscaler. It's really good. This is the home screen of SoMake AI. Without much being said, let's check the image generator tool. Here's the default image generator that was here. So we're just gonna put our own prompt and see how this AI handles it. It generates and we wait. A few moments later. And boom, here we have it. You can see how this AI really got the whole prompt very well, even better than the previous one. Here's my name on the wall. Here's my setup. Here's everything. It really captured the blue tones and everything. So let's try another prompt out, the same prompt, but with a different model. And let's see how this model handles it. Hit generate. And then boom, you can see that this model really got the prompt perfectly. And I really love this image. I even used it as my wallpaper because it got the whole prompt very well and even added some extra details to it. So yeah, I feel this AI is really good, especially for it to be free. It's totally free for y'all to check out. I'm just gonna try another prompt right now. And then boom. It really got it. Her shirt, her skirt, her hair, the prompt looks like real life. Here's another image I created with that same prompt, but with different models, and it really got the prompt well. This is amazing. So you all should go ahead and check the link in my Discord. My Discord link is in the description. So yeah, I'm just gonna sign out. Next time I'll be using this, I'll have full credits. So you all should stick around and wait for my next video. I'll be teaching you about that. That's all for today's video. If you really loved it, like and subscribe and join the community to get more fresh updates. I'll be dropping the links in my Discord along with the prompts I used. And without much being said, peace out guys.